Muy buenas a todos chicos y chicas y bienvenidos de nuevo al canal, soy Tony Balbuena y aquí os traigo la segunda parte del octavo episodio y final de Minecraft Story Mode titulado El final del viaje, continuamos como siempre en el punto exacto donde lo dejamos en el anterior episodio y desde aquí vamos a continuar como siempre raudos y veloces Antes de nada vamos a hablar un poquito con este caballero que en la parte anterior no tuve eh, demasiado tiempo para hablar con él What do you know about the old builders who run this place? Well, one, they hate being called old builders. Two, their face meets bosses. Three, they're not big on hugs. Vale, eso se le llama un resumen breve. Hey, what do you even do around here? Facemeat cracks skulls and thinks about cracking more skulls. When Facemeat has time, that is. Qué simpático. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines. Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on Facemeat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Staring at Facemeat. Please, what can I do to get them out? Well, now that you mention it, Facemeat was busy slamming mad rabs at the gym and missed lunchtime. You see? So Facemeat's hungry. Do something about that, and Facemeat will think about getting your friends out. Me da a mí que no los va a traer igualmente, pero bueno. Vamos a darnos una vueltecita. A ver, vamos a hablar con esta buena muchacha que hay por aquí. Nel. Me gusta ese nombre. Wow, it's you from Spleef. You were like amazing. I am now. And I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your prods upset. Especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> I understand, Nell. These games are nuts. Man, I am so glad to hear that. I do not... Uy, ya empezamos con los subtítulos. I gotta say, you keep playing like that and you'll be like... Tim status. Tim who? Tim! Like the legend of Tim Tim. On the signs. Like one, okay? Like you could. People could like already be talking. They're gonna like say stuff. Compare you to Tim. That's right. I'm gonna win the games too. No doubt. No doubt. Okay, don't like tell anyone, but I would rather be on your team. Green team captain is like pff, she is so not chill. Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you, so if you ever need anything, you just come and ask, shall? No, I mean seriously. I mean anything at all. Like I want to help out people. Well, actually, do you have any extra food? Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash, and if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees us. Vamos a seguirla despacito. Que no nos vea nadie. Seguramente será una contrabandista de comida. Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, bra. It'll grow back. Just uh, leave the seeds, yeah? De acuerdo. One. As I go. Venga, vamos, 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 que no tenemos todo el día, tío. Venga, yes. And that's another. Sweet. And that should all grow back soon. Nice. Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully, bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Pues qué fastidio, ¿y cómo se supone que tengo que hacer el pan? Where can I get some wood planks? Hey, I remember a bunch of like wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by like punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no problem. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Muy bien. El dojo. El dojo se supone que es esto que hay aquí o el dojo, sí, guay. Mm, junto al dojo, junto al dojo o dentro del dojo. Mm, 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 mm. Creo que ha dicho junto al dojo, pero. 
Hmm, some sort of practice space. Looks like everyone's working hard. Oh, smells like it too. <laughs> Bueno, pues a ver cómo entro en el... A ver si podemos pasar... No, no, me dejan pasar. ¡Qué mala gente! ¿Habéis visto que tiene bloques de, de hierro en las manos? Hey, no hard feelings. I didn't know what I'd gotten into. Let's just move past this. No. I will eliminate you next round and make you suffer. It'll be fun for me. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long, so you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Please, they don't seem so tough. Then you haven't been paying close enough attention. Or you're cocky. Either way, bad business. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Have you ever won the games? Yeah. I won, but I decided to give up the prize of going home to stay in this awesome place. Sarcasmo? Of course I haven't won. Obviamente. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. Vale, parece que nos han despejado el camino. Vamos a pegarle una leche buena. Y... Ha sido fácil. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Una mesa de creación buena y bonita y barata. Ahí la tenemos. Ahora un poquito de pan. Eh... Vale, yo, ya sabéis que yo no sé, yo no sé craftear de forma tradicional. Llevo tiempo queriendo poner el Minecraft en crafteo de este tipo, pero de verdad que si no hay las recetas en el propio juego, paso. Tengo que mirarlo, pero es que si no va a ser muy chungo y me voy a volver loco. Hola, buen hombre. Hola. Um, Hey, face me. Got some bread for you. Bread, huh? It's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mm, it's Pobrecito. warm. Oh, and full of carbs. It took me a long time to make that bread, so you better hold up your end of the deal. Jeez, face me. Didn't know you were so demanding. Wait here. Me ha sido fácil, ¿no creéis? Petra. Hey, Algo no me huele bien. You already figured out the whole Nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. First with Palma, now with that stupid sploof game. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. No hay de qué. You know. Para eso están los amigos y los futuros esposos. It was just on my mind, and I thought I should say something. Hey, of course I saved you, okay? You're one of my best friends. Well, I just hope Ivor isn't too jealous. Si está celoso que se aguante. A mí me gustan las chicas. No los chicos. Response. Jesse, man, is it good to see you? You too, Lucas. And Ivor. Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Parece un, el típico traje de baño antiguo, ¿no? Anyway, los años 20 o por ahí. You uh you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary. Sorry. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. Jesse, don't worry. We're just in this tournament where if we win, 
We get the Atlas and our ticket home. Oh, well, that's better than I thought. But if we lose, we'll be mining for quartz forever. Nope, that is not a thing I want. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just uh, stare at you while you mine. We can't just leave. I really think we can win this. Good. We need to. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. So you're the one who's supposed to help us? Well, I'll enforce the rules at any rate. If that helps you, then uh, can't be games without rules. <laughs> Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting, you being here. I can feel change in the air. Great, as long as I get to go home. That is the point, but you have to win first. And my job is to make sure everybody, even Hadrian, plays by the rules. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what the next event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! <laughs> bueno, siguiente parte terminada, creo. Logro, supongo. Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the game. Ahí está. <laughs> it's gonna be... Jugar para ganar. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleef, I'm afraid to say that the red team... Parecen de un equipo de Boss Lake. ¿Sabéis eso que es como un trineo que se tira por la nieve en los Juegos de Invierno por una especie de, de carril? Los equipos parecen de eso, sacados de, de los Juegos de Invierno de Boss Lake. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. I wonder how this is gonna go. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these pompous jerks. Yeah, I'm right there with you. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race! We've totally got this! <laughs> got this, huh? Boom! Oh. Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. We have appearances to keep up here. Winning. Ooh, in the zone, huh? That's excellent. That's just excellent. Hope you managed to hang on to that optimism when the heat's on out there. De la competencia o de la competición, ha dicho. Creo que se equivoca. But I must ask, what makes you think you can win when so many others have failed? Huh? Do you really think you're special? 
whatever you're throwing at us can't be any worse than the other stuff we've already survived. Oh, really? Because it seems like two members of your team have already been eliminated. Yeah, and there's two left. More than enough to win this. Yes, perhaps we should just get on with this. <laughs> What a lovely day for a game. No sé por qué, pero este hombre me recuerda un poco a Vegeta. Jesse, good luck out there. Vegeta 777. I'm sure you'll be great. Ya sabéis, eres muy buenos a todos, guapísimos. Oh, I am glad to see my charms finally wore you down. Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and I thought, an enemy of my enemy is my friend. Whoa, that means M wants to be like friends with you, Jesse. What? M might be up to something. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <sighs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. I'm just trying to be nice, I swear. No me fío nada de ella. In the middle of the race is a part with de la otra sí, pero de esta no. Ears. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay too. I'm gonna stick with my team, and you should stick with yours. Fine, I'll do that. No hay trato, chicos, no me fío de ella. Sí, a Gladiator Junction. Me sabe mal por la otra chica, por la rubia, que ha sido buena con nosotros, pero es lo que hay. De la grande no me fío ni un pelo. Estoy seguro que nos traicionaría de alguna forma. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's gonna involve a lot of punching and kicking. Give them all you got, Petra. I've been waiting all day for you to say that. Bueno, bueno, chicos, a ver qué nos depara este esta nueva prueba. Nada bueno, seguramente. It is a total bummer that we are not going to be able to, you know, work together. Sorry you're going to lose now. I still think you're awesome though. Competitors on your mark. En sus marcas. Get set. Preparados. Go. Ya. Vamos allá, chicos. Ya. Acumula esto Ojo Vamos Estaba atento ahí Cuidadito Perfecto ¡Uh! ¡Oh, ¡Madre mía, chaval! Eso no lo hacen ni en Matrix, ¿eh? ¡Ojo! He nacido para hacer esto, chicos He nacido para hacer esto Ahora por listos cuando me caigo la lava Y... Toco el botón A, vale Tocamos, saltamos otra vez Saltamos otra vez Saltamos otra vez Uf. Qué justito, chicos Faltó poco Ojo Madre mía, yo no tengo Flechas Pero tengo una bonita espada Toma, chúpate esa Flanders. Ah, que puedo moverme también. Vale. Lo siento, amigo. Más suerte la próxima. Qué fuerte, tío. Si estoy tocando los botones. Es que yo creo que está un poco bugueado esto. Ahora sí, hombre. Vamos. ¿Y esta nueva zona qué? Okay, sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? Madre mía. Well, that answers that question. Look out, arrow! 
Madre mía, qué salvajada, tío. ¡Qué emoción! ¡Eres muy lento, amigo! ¡Gracias, Petra! ¡No! ¡Otra vez no! ¿Cómo me puede pasar lo mismo por segunda vez? ¿Os creéis muy valientes, eh? ¡Me las pagaréis! Pero eso será en el próximo episodio, porque se nos ha acabado el tiempo. Lo siento, chicos, sé que os habéis quedado con las ganas, pero así seguro que no os perdéis el próximo episodio. Como siempre, muchísimas gracias a todos por verme y por aguantarme. Espero que hayáis disfrutado de este episodio. Si así ha sido, ya sabéis que podéis apoyar el vídeo puntuando a me gusta, comentar, compartir y añadir a favoritos que siempre me ayuda un montón. Y cualquier pregunta, duda o sugerencia os invito a que dejéis vuestro comentario. Un saludo y nos vemos mañana en el siguiente episodio. No os lo perdáis. Adiós.